Hey everyone, it's Anne. Welcome back to Keto Asian Flavors. Let's make some ketchup flavored pork rinds today using just a few ingredients. In a pot or a wok, add enough water to cover 2 to 3 pounds of pig skin. While the water is preheating, clean the pig skin under cold water a few times. Add in one tablespoon of sea salt. Then add in the pig skin. If you wish, you can add some ginger slices to help get rid of the smell. Cook for about 20 to 25 minutes until the skin is soft. Transfer the pig skin to a large bowl and rinse it under warm water. Use a paper towel to pat dry, then cut into smaller pieces. Remove the excess fat from the skin with a knife. You can save the fat to render lard if you wish. Cut the skin to desired size and set aside in a large bowl. I'm cutting it into strips so that it will curl up. You can cut it into squares if you wish, the shape doesn't really matter. Add in one tablespoon of sea salt. Add in two tablespoons of distilled vinegar and mix well to combine. The vinegar will help make it extra crispy. This is one of two methods. If you have a dehydrator, use it to dehydrate the skin. So here's a hack to make ketchup seasoning. Use sugar-free ketchup and dehydrate it on a silicone mat. Spread it out thinly and dehydrate with the pork skin. Dehydrate the pork skin and the sugar-free ketchup at about 155 degrees Fahrenheit for about 8 to 10 hours. The ketchup doesn't really need to be dehydrated for that long, I just kept it in there for the whole time. After 8 to 10 hours, it should be fully dried. This is what it looks like. To shallow fry, fill a small saucepan with avocado oil and fry at 375 degrees Fahrenheit until it's puffy and golden brown. If using the air fryer, set the temperature to 375 degrees Fahrenheit and air fry for 5 minutes. It will puff up without the use of oil. I prefer this method better than shallow frying because it reminds me of these traditional pork rinds. To make the ketchup seasoning, all you have to do is just put in the coffee grinder to grind it into a powder. I only fried up about one eighth of the pig skin I prepared earlier. I kept the rest in a Ziploc bag refrigerated. Add the pork rinds and the ketchup powder to a large Ziploc bag. Seal the bag and shake it to distribute the seasonings evenly. 
Thanks for watching everyone. Please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you enjoy my recipes. If you would like to support me on Patreon, I'll link it down below. I'll see you again in the next video.